I started playing, you know, quite young, maybe four or five, just knocking it around. But then it was um, the age of seven that I really started to play properly with uh, some coaching and, and things like that and um, fell in love with the game. I was quite good at um, junior level, particularly within England, um, number one at every age group through the juniors, but I was never really 100% sure that it was always something that I was going to do. And I deferred my uni place and then decided to go full time for two years and see how, how it panned out. And that was 10 years ago. My game's quite steady. Um, you know, I play probably the traditional English way, maybe a lot to the back of the court. But that's probably where my game's improved a lot, a lot more recently over the last year. I've been taking the ball in to the front a little bit more, you know, and I've got a little bit quicker and a little bit fitter. So I'd just say my game overall is, is solid and strong in most areas of the court. And I've been trying to build the attacking side a little bit more and that's probably been the difference to get me to two in the world so far. This season's been really good, I've managed to understand myself a little bit better physically and mentally. When I go home from tournaments I can look at how much time I've got at home and work my training around what I feel I need to do before the next event. There's the, the brilliant thing about playing squash, there's always another event just around the corner so you never really have to wait that long to try and rectify anything that's gone wrong and, and that's a really good thing about it. I'm playing with the Zenon uh, 135 and um, I feel like it gives me a really good balance of um, power and feel on all the shots and uh, you know I've got four in my bag and you know whichever one I pick up is going to be exactly the same. It's a brilliant racket, it's really durable too so it's good. I guess everyone's dream is to become world number one and if I'm honest I'm surprised that you know I, I did so well to get to number two but now I'm here I'm, I'm nowhere near finished so I just want to carry on keep working hard on my game and keep enjoying it and hopefully you kind of reap the rewards that come with that by winning major titles and hopefully transferring that into becoming world number one.